North America has developed a land transportation system second to none in the world. Two million miles of asphalt streets and highways form the backbone of this system. The continued growth and the rehabilitation and maintenance of this infrastructure is vital to maintaining our standard of living and the economic competitiveness of the United States. Currently, county, state, and federal highway agencies allow the use of several paving technologies. Cold in place recycling is an outstanding rehabilitation alternative. Used extensively since the 1970s, cold in place recycling is also one of the most cost effective processes, providing dramatic cost savings of between 30 and 50 percent when compared to conventional overlay alternatives. Ongoing improvements in equipment, binders, and additives will ensure the future growth of cold in place recycling. The benefits of pavement recycling operations include low first cost, low life cycle cost, reduced time of occupancy on our nation's highways while the rehabilitation alternatives are being performed, that it conserves aggregates and asphalts, and also reduces the flow of material to our nation's landfills. Cold in place recycling is a simple process that uses the old hot mix asphalt and emulsion for cohesion and hot lime slurry to quickly stabilize the mixture. Hot lime slurry functions in part like a mineral filler. It can help to alter the chemistry of an aggregate surface and the asphalt binder. Testing has proven hot lime slurry is effective in reducing the stripping potential of hot mix asphalt mixtures, as well as aiding in dewatering that enables better curing of the asphalt emulsion. Valentine Surfacing, Vancouver, Washington, and Chemical Lime Company, Fort Worth, Texas, during the summer of 1995, combined forces in Idaho and Oregon on four separate cold-in-place recycling projects. Highway 95 in Rome, Oregon, 15 miles or 30 lane miles. The south entrance to Crater Lake National Park, Oregon, 7 miles. Highways 8 and 6 in Deary, Idaho, 17 miles or 34 lane miles. And 13 miles of pavement in Banks, Idaho. These resurfacing jobs were completed using Valentine Surfacing's innovative recycling train and Chemical Lime's Portabatch Mobile Hot Lime Slurry Production System. Hot lime slurry is loaded from the transfer trailer into the surge trailer, which measures and distributes the slurry into the cold milling machine. The oil trailer supplies the mixing unit at the back of the train. Lime slurry is transferred from the surge trailer directly into the cold milling machine head while the existing pavement is pulverized. The cold milling machine picks up the reclaimed asphalt and conveys the blend to the crushing and screening unit. The recycled asphalt pavement is sized by the crushing and screening unit and transferred to the mixing unit where an emulsifier or additive is incorporated. The mixture is deposited into a windrow and then transferred to a paving laydown machine for spreading. Finally, the recycled product is compacted using a conventional pneumatic tired and steel wheeled roller. There are several advantages to the contractor to use lime in the recycling. One is the initial uh, reduction of wear and, and abuse of the equipment. The material then handles easier, it compacts easier, your densities come higher, quicker, and therefore you can get traffic back on it quicker, and there's also the reduction of potential w later weather damage because of the reduced cure time. Chemical Lime has made the use of hot lime slurry at remote sites remarkably simple through its portabatch system. Chemical Lime provides the portabatch units and qualified personnel to slake quicklime into quality hot lime slurry. Chemical Lime delivers the quicklime in a pneumatic tanker truck in 27 ton loads. The quicklime is blown into the portabatch under the level of the surcharged water, thereby eliminating the escape of fugitive dust. The quicklime is mixed with water, making the slurry. The slurry ranges in temperature from 160 to 212 degrees Fahrenheit when thoroughly slaked and has a percent solids of approximately 40. The slurry is then loaded into the trailer for transfer to the recycling train. The slurry is, is closely controlled. You can put the percentage in you want all the time uh, and it's continuous feed. The advantage of using the hot lime slurry is that it improves the water sensitivity of the mixes, but more importantly, it, Im it improves the high early strength characteristics of the mixes when compared with mixes uh, with no lime. And this is important in that it, 
it allows one to extend the construction season, uh, particularly in cold climates. As you can see from this chart, uh, the index of retained modulus is improved substantially with the addition of lime to the cold in place recycling. This demonstrates a, a, a tremendous improvement in water resistance or resistance stripping. Uh, furthermore, the, uh, the chart also indicates uh, that there is a higher early strength with cold in place recycled mixes when compared with similar mixes without lime. And these values are comparable to a uh, dense graded hot mix. Cold in place recycling with hot lime slurry offers many long term benefits, including substantial improvement of initial strength and an increase in ultimate strength development, reduction of moisture susceptibility, dramatic improvements in curing rates, increased resistance to freeze thaw damage, rutting resistance can be improved, raveling is reduced and sometimes eliminated and delay time before rolling is reduced. In addition, stripped pavements can be recycled, and if desired, a fog seal may also be applied over the surface to further protect recycled material. Approximately 90% of surfaced roadways in North America have asphalt surfaces that will eventually require rehabilitation. Cold in-place recycling saves state departments of transportation time and money and protects precious natural resources through the reuse of existing pavement materials. Cold in-place recycling is the solution for the future. Chemical Lime Company is the nation's leading producer and supplier of lime-based, solutions-oriented products for industrial, municipal, and environmental projects. Headquartered in Fort Worth, Chemical Lime has 40 locations nationwide and serves the highway construction asphalt, building construction, water, wastewater, copper, gold and alumina processing, steel, paper, and flue gas desulfurization industries.